watching this month's Quick Tip. I'm Kevin Deusterhouse with Weber. In this Quick Tip, I'm going to show you how to measure and adjust the blade gap of your Weber slicer. It's necessary to check the blade gap after installing a new shear edge. This is an important adjustment for getting perfect quality slices on your slicer. It's important that you use metal reinforced gloves when working with blades. First, install the blade and remove the blade guard. Then release the brake on the blade and move it in front of the shear edge. Use a feeler gauge to measure the gap between the blade and the shear edge. The measurement should be between 0.5 millimeters and 1 millimeter. If the gap is too large or too small, then we need to adjust it. Before adjusting the gap, move the blade back up to the top position out of your way and install the blade guard. There are two bolts on the front of the shear edge mount and two bolts directly on the opposite side. To increase the gap, loosen the bolts on the back side. Turn the front bolts to the right and then tighten the bolts on the back side. To decrease the gap, loosen the front bolts, turn the back bolts to the right, and then tighten the front bolts. Once your adjustment has been made, remove the blade guard and perform another measurement of the gap to verify. If needed, perform the adjustment again until you have the perfect gap. Follow this quick tip to set the blade gap and ensure your slicer is operating at its optimal performance. Thanks for watching this episode of Weber Quick Tips. See you next month.